the Feast of Gifts. I've no idea why. Loads of footprints. A crowd of peasants came through here. Avalach claims vanity is Imlaris' greatest weakness. Vanity? Any foe he faces, he strives to impress. The other one, Caranthir, is said to be secretive and pragmatic. Hardly surprising, given he was Avalach's student. Should I shoot? White one once served the ladies. But he's an old. Let them approach. But they've come for the feast. Wouldn't do to cast them out. Didn't come to celebrate. We need to get to the top of the mountain. The gate is shut. You'll not pass. But we fires down that away with food and drink aplenty. Sit down beside one, and perhaps this year the ladies will descend. Give us the privilege of seeing them. We thank you for the invitation. Be glad to sit down, right? Speak for yourself. Come with me. Mentioned a gate, said we wouldn't pass. Only the chosen visit the ladies. Every year, young lads and lasses climb the mount, but never more than three. Let me guess, the young lads and lasses don't return. No, they return happy and radiant. But rare is the one who then stays in Velen. Off they go to seek fortune in the wider world. Ladies of the wood visit you? If they favor us. My father told me they descended once. Passed from fire to fire, listening to hopes and grievances. So each year, we wait for them to walk amongst us once more. Haven't done it in a long time, then. No point waiting to see if we'll get lucky. Yeah, we gotta try to reach the peak. We should be going. Eager to see the ladies. I share your yearning. We're a fire with yearning. Come, Geralt. We must get there before daybreak. Go to the tent and stand before Thecla. She's the one who decides who's worthy to face the ladies. Already. That's him. We can never know. We each will. Yeah? Let me see what you...
for a hard winter. Don't you get plenty, don't ye, friend? The good ladies, merciful ladies. My grandson, give him health. He works his share of mischief. Look, a child. No, a godling. I know him. Name's Johnny. Well, old B, you're back. Uh, and I see you found your lass. I'm Johnny. We've had the pleasure already. A bit one-sided, though, it was. See, I saw you running. You're back to me. As I was <laughs> having the pleasure of... Oh, tis a long story. They call me Siri. Nice to meet you. How are things, Johnny? Health's good, so no complaints. What brings you here? We gotta climb the mountain. Can you help? I'd rather try to dissuade you, but I'm certain that would be in vain. The lass, she is stubborn as you. Even more so. Figured as much. Oh, path to the peak starts there, past the gate. But only old Thekla's got the key, so since you shan't ever get it, you best turn back now. The key. Why do you doubt we can get it? Oh, good grief! You're worse than children! Three souls are allowed atop the mountain, and only strapping young lads or comely lasses among them. They get the key, open the gate, and meet the ladies. I believe I qualify. But he's old and ugly. What good is he? Pretty damn good at finding lost voices. Then go find the voice of reason. It'll tell you to turn back. There's no fooling with the ladies. We're here to find an elf named Imlarith. Siri thinks he might be a guest of the crones. Big bloke, in full plate? Going the right way. He's atop the mountain, all right. You've seen him? Saw him in the bog first. Water froze beneath his horse's hooves. Then I saw him again yesterday, heading up this path. Why are you looking for him? He killed my friend. Wouldn't seek revenge if I were you. Even the ladies bow and scrape before that one. Gotta get to the summit. Simple as that. It's Thecla you'll need to convince. She's blind as your bum, but she won't be fooled. We shan't try to trick her. She sits in that tent over yonder. I wish you luck, and do hope we meet again, someday. Moons are rising up. Owls hooting, fires just a gleam. Hours late and slumber cozy. Not ready. It's, it's, not what? Not it's clearing up. Mm. Who's that? Well, come on, come closer, girl. Aye. What's she like? Narrow hips, sparkly eyes, a striking feisty lass. Never had a man. <sighs> Never mind. Got me answer. I choose you, girl. This night you shall see the ladies. Siri. Wonderful. Who wouldn't want to meet the ladies? My companion comes with me. <laughs> what else has the cat dragged in? It's grey and veiny, got a scar, and eyes like a viper. Aye. Stinks of clotted blood and corpses. Plus it's old and infertile. I reject ye, freak. The girl will ascend alone.
I'm going with her. <laughs> He's firing his gut. What do you see? He's determined. He loves the girl, but he seeks to hide it from us. Perhaps I was mistaken. Perhaps there's life in him yet. By ancient right, you may appeal my choice. But to do so, you must best the challenge. I accept the challenge. <laughs> Come. Look this over. A coin from days of yore. Falker burns on its reverse, so they call it the Defiers Oran. Now, bring me the coin. <laughs> ah! Something's afoot. Something's nigh.
beginning to worry. Something's afoot. Come. They're back. What do you want? Got that coin you tossed in the lake. It reeks of sludge. Nothing I can do about that. So, gonna keep your word? I always do, my boy. Show the coin to the gatekeeper past the threshold. He'll know its meaning. Marika will open the gate for ye. Now go! That went smoothly. Weren't the one to do the diving in that cave. You're a witcher. You've dived in murkier waters. Yeah, I have to tell you about the time I hunted a zoo. What's your name, girl? What's yours? <clears throat> your name don't matter. Atop the peak, you'll lose it and get another. You may go. And you? Got something to do up there, so just let us through. <laughs> Given me orders? You? A human? I passed the trial. Here's proof. Recognize it? The Defiers, Oren. A death sentence. No time to lose. I'll tend to Imlirith, you take the crones. Avalark said they dwell below the oak, among its roots. No chance. I'm going after Imlirith. <sighs> Fine, let's play for it. Rock, paper, scissors. Damn it! Two out of three! Out of the question. I'll climb the mountain, you face the crones. Hardly a challenge. They're extremely dangerous. Be careful. You too. Let's get down there. Oh, hell. I guess I must jump.
how was he? He lived a life of love and knew no bitterness. Return. Your taste lingers on our tongues. You've talked enough. Your life is ours. You'll not leave me. Naughty, naughty girl! He must be punished. Your life, your blood, your heart. You will die here now. Your life is ours. You must be punished.
damn it. Imbrits at the summit. Gotta be. Medallion's humming. Place of power, it's gotta be. Sisters said you would come. They saw you arrive in the water's surface. They did not see the girl. But she is with you, is she not? I'm here alone. A lie which will change nothing. First you, then. Show me what you got. Your head 
from my saddle. you to fight like this. The Witcher you slew. We did it. Barely. How'd it go down there? I slew only two of the crones. The third fled. With Vesemir's medallion. My sole memento. Coming here? Good idea. I knew we'd succeed. From the start. Now to find Eredin and kill him. An Orin for your thoughts? Wondering what to tell Yennefer when we get to Novigrad. Tell her the truth. Always. I wonder if Triss and Yennefer have found the sorceresses of the Lodge. We ought to rejoin them. Yeah, let's get going. Thank you for coming with me. Come here. <laughs> Let's go. The Oak is dead. The Oak, the Crones. I fear that was your last feast. What of our acorns? Don't know, don't care. You must learn to live without them. This is no longer no man's land. It's no longer the lady's land. It's all yours. What are we to do? Come, Geralt. It's time. Manage. On your own.
Then non-humans. Thought it was mages the hunters and the temple guard were after. Mages left. Hunters needed a new quarry. Hatred and prejudice will never be eradicated. And witch hunts will never be about witches. To have a scapegoat, that's the key. Humans always fear the alien, the odd. Once the mages had left Novigrad, folk turned their anger against the other races. And as they have for ages, branded their neighbors their greatest foes. Dundee Lion! Ready some tankards! With guests! Geralt! Siri! When I learned Geralt had found you... Glad to see you in one piece too, Dandelion. Where have you two been? Just finished hunting down the crones of Velen and a general of the Wild Hunt. Well, you were a busy morn then, haven't you? In fact, you look terrible. Like you could really use some rest. Gladly take some. Point me to a room. Of course. Come on, little swallow. I'll take you. Let's meet later, Geralt. I have a little matter to resolve. I'll freshen up, then await you in the square in Gildorf. Right. Anyone here besides us? Lodge of sorceresses. Triss and Yen were supposed to gather the remnants. They're working on it. Triss is upstairs, waiting for you. Yennefer's gone to crippled Kate's. Yen? At that portside dive? Why? Didn't inform me. Imagine that. Ah, and that elf of yours moved into the ruby suite. Told me to tell you he's waiting too. Thanks. Looks like I'll have my hands full. Oh, I've worked up quite the appetite. How much for the... Oh! Need a hanky? Gotta admit, never expected this of you. You humans have... Mm, unusual tastes. How did you fare on Bald Mountain? Need to ask? You're a sage. I ask as a courtesy. A concept you clearly forgot when you left without uttering a word. Siri was in a hurry. I know, so she wrote in her letter. But that is not my concern. You eliminated Imlareth adeptly. So adeptly, you might say you inspired me. Meaning? The loss of one of his great generals has weakened Eredin significantly. Two others remain. How do we get rid of them? Caranthia is a loyalist, but Gels, that is another story. He was a devoted follower of our former king. And as it happens, Eredin poisoned our beloved ruler. Regicide. Serious stuff. Take it not many know about this. Of the living, only I. 
And Eredin, of course. Question is, can you get Gels to believe you? Nothing you need worry about. Fine. So what do you propose? Why, to bring Gels here? Show him the truth of what happened? Fabulous plan, if we only knew where to find him. We do. In the land of the NL. Think you're forgetting something? You and Siri might know how to travel between worlds, but me? Not so much. You clearly know there are many other worlds apart from the one where we now stand. They're linked by passages, hidden gateways that afford travel from one world to another. Of course, few know of these gateways. Even fewer can locate them. Elven sages, for example? For example. One such passage will open soon near where we are, fortuitously enough. Between this noble edifice and the butcher's yard. That's our chance. Shall we go? Let's go. I know this house. Supposed to drive a godling from here. Supposed to? Decided it was harmless. Passage is here, past this wall. This is the place. Once we enter, there'll be no returning until we reach Gels. Ready? Yes, let's go. Remember, wherever you land, search for a place that looks like this one. We shall meet sooner or later. Mean we'll be separated? It's possible. I lack your ward's talent. Zirel is the lady of time and space. I merely know how to use this arcane knowledge to a limited degree. It's time. I hate portals.
Welcome to the Diderwet Desert. There's somewhere in our world. Ever seen such canyons in your world? Come, we must go. What is this place? A very old world, thoroughly raped and destroyed. Anything live here? Mainly desert creatures, able to survive months on end without water. Oh, and large sand crabs beneath the surface. We must be careful they don't sense us. And before, were there any people or elves? Do you believe humanoids have a monopoly on destroying worlds? So what did live here? Sentient monsters of some sort? Look at those cliffs. Remind you of anything? Hmm. Look a bit like the bed of a giant river. Or the bottom of a sea. Mean there were water creatures here once? No creatures. Merely a sea. Trying to say that... That there are many different worlds and even more forms of life. Many of them intelligent, much more so in fact than you humans. But as it turns out, not even that could stop them from exhausting all the resources of their world. To the last drop. Ah, the portal. Looks more like a ruin. Appearances can be deceiving. So what are we waiting for? For it to open. Shouldn't take but a few moments. What's going on? The sand crabs have sensed our presence. Wonderful. Vapors don't look terribly inviting. <coughs> Damn it, gotta hold my breath. Any longer and I'd have suffocated.
dead for the place somewhere. And I gotta find that next passage quick. If I can just find cover along the way, I should make it to the passage. like this. Someone must have lit it. With any luck, it was a certain grouchy elven sage. Snow's up to the rooftops. Wonder how long this blizzard's been blowing. Of course. What else? Might have expected this. Took you a while? Did you run into trouble? Uh, no. Just taking in the sights. What is this place? Feels like I've been here before. You have. You fought Eridan's projection here. Before that, Siri fought here. For you. What are you talking about? Ever wondered how you managed to leave the Red Riders? Many times, but I don't remember a thing. Siri came for you. She sensed you were in danger, tore you from the hunt's grasp, then deposited you in the woods near Kaer Morhen. Did Aridan start hunting her because of that? Because of me? Why didn't she say anything? <sighs> what would it have changed? Going after Gels is proving quite a trek. 
but I still don't know why he's so important. Eredin differs from the king he killed. Power for its own sake interests him. He has little patience for bureaucracy. He spends most of his time atop his steed, leading the Red Riders. So what does he need in the capital? A good viceroy. Gels is an excellent administrator and an even better plotter. He's the most dangerous individual amongst the NL. He got any weaknesses? Yes. He's righteous. Where are we? World of the NL? No. This is Ted Dera, the time of the end. The world destroyed by the White Frost. Alas, this awaits us all, though at differing stages of our existence. So calm when you say that. Eredin succumbed to his knowledge of the Apocalypse. Fear rules him now. I'll not commit the same error. Care to clarify? Not here. Not now. Doesn't look safe here either. Let's go. This way. Next passage. When will it open? Shortly. of Awakening, formerly the Moon Palace, Gel's headquarters. <sighs> Beautiful. I'm glad to know you appreciate it. Elven architecture is a bit more sophisticated than yours. Oh, who's this? And why are they here? I believe we're done for the day, my tulip. Be a dear and leave us alone. For I think we can agree this matter is between us and us alone, correct? Crivana, Spain, Ap Coman Maca, and the Witcher of Rivia. Ketmill. Do you like my new model? Something of Lara Doran about her, wouldn't you agree, Grievan? Her height, perhaps. Nothing more. <laughs> I see I've touched a tender spot. So let's change the subject, shall we? Care for a drink? Didn't come here for tea. Hmm. I must admit, you appearing here, quite the surprise, Witcher. Incidentally, interesting choice of allies. Do you think Avalach is honest with you? Just curious. I think that even among the NL elves, there are those capable of being decent. <laughs> Naivety is a fool's blessing. I detect a shadow of impatience in your faces, it seems. So what brings you here? I've come to tell you who killed our king. You've gone through a great deal of trouble to reach me. So I must believe you've put equal effort into preparing this lie. You shall see the truth. You will dream it. You've been a neuromancer. My intuition was correct. This will be interesting.
tired of your pseudo-sophisticated courtesy. Let's go. Where to, if I might ask? To the world of the Enche. Directly this time. Let's go, before any guards show up. I take it I needn't introduce our guest. Greetings, Tsirael. So it's true. The swallow has befriended the fox. There's naught you can do to make us turn on one another. Havalach blackmailed you. Do you not remember? He tried to force you to warm our king's bed. Treated your body like a side of pork. I remember. But I also remember what you advised Eredin do with me once I was caught. And I remember what the Red Riders did at Kaer Morhen. I didn't come here to argue. The proof you promised. Where is it? You will see it. In your dream. Ah, yes. The Oneiromancer. Visions that cannot be fabricated. Do you wish to show me how Eredin murdered our king? What then? Am I to incite the NL against Eredin? Call for revolution? and proclaim Avalach our new king. Don't flatter yourself. Defy Aridin. That's all you need to do. Very well. Have your oracle summon dreams of my king's last moments. We shall all dream them, to make certain there are no misunderstandings. Why not? You must face him on your terms, in this world, in a place of your choosing. It's your only chance. Sail to Skellige and find the Sunstone. With it, you will summon the Nargofair. Eredin will come too. Should he call for reinforcements, no NL will answer. You have done the thing most just. A new portal to Tin Alia will open. I shall stabilize it and you will return. Come with me. Just as well. Could have been bluffing. Might have just said that so we'd let him go. Damn it. We should have pressed him. Calm down. Avalark knows him better. We'll hear him out when he returns. Speak of the devil. Geralt's worried. He believes we let girls go too easily. Be too careful. Agreed. Yet I do believe Gels will keep his word. 
withhold support from Eredin. Seems to me you have a plan. Care to share it with us? Once we find the Sunstone, aided by your sorceresses and their magic, we shall draw Eredin's ship to a bay along the coast of Undvik. We will wait in ambush, lay a trap. When the King of the Hunt arrives, we will spring it and kill him. Just like that? Defeating Eredin will be no small feat, but we will accomplish it. Find the sorceresses at the Lodge, and we'll meet at the port. Then we sail to Skellige. Couldn't help it. I'm curious about this little matter you have to resolve. When I was last in Elvigrad, I had my share of troubles. So I heard. A few people helped me then. Others, not so much. Now I mean to repay them both. Coming with? Lead the way. We need to go to Temple Isle. Don't remember you being religious? Nor am I now. Let's go. Almost there. Where are we going exactly? To see Horson Jr. Lead the way. Why are you doing this again? <laughs> 